Hi, this is Paul with Modern Driveline. In this video segment, we're going to talk about the fundamentals of setting up your master cylinder system. We're going to focus on two styles, the direct connect and our reduction linkage system. We'll start here. The reduction linkage system has an articulating arm or lever that pushes the master cylinder rod in and out. When it does this, the master cylinder rod moves in an arc. That's fine for one direction and it's fine for the master cylinder rod, but for the reduction linkage that's attached to the clutch pedal and the lever, not so much. It's important that your rod ends, also known as rose joints or hind joints, be directly behind one another. Now these joints will articulate and move around quite a bit, but imagine if they were just directly connected behind one another. That is what your system should look like installed. Not like this, not like that. This can be adjusted with the use of washers that we supply in our master cylinder kit. If you're wondering about this little red dude right here, that actually goes inside the clutch pedal to take a 7 16 hole down to a 5 16 hole. It's important to put a washer on each side so that that is well supported. To check the throw or travel of your master cylinder rod, it's very difficult to do that under the dash, so here's a little trick. Take a Sharpie marker, and mark a vertical line on your clevis pin. Doesn't matter where. Then you take a six inch scale, a popsicle stick, whatever you got, a couple pieces of tape or rubber bands even, and put it against a single location on your firewall and put it in line with the mark you made on your clevis. When you stroke your master cylinder, you will get an obvious amount of travel. Put your other piece of tape at that location and measure between your two tape joints so that you can see how much movement you have. On the reduction linkage systems, to get more travel, you do two adjustments at the same time. First, you disconnect the rod end from the clutch pedal and loosen this jam nut. You bring these two rod ends closer together at the same time. You loosen this 12 millimeter jam nut against the gold clevis and extend that out, showing more threads on the master cylinder. By having less movement here means less articulation and makes it more direct, one-to-one. -one. Closer you get to zero, the more one-to-one -one you are. Obviously, you can't get to zero because of the reduction linkage system. The reduction linkage system is designed so you have full pedal stroke and have no need to use a pedal stop. Moving on to our direct connect systems, similar action. The rod will move in an articulating motion in and out of our master cylinder. To verify that you have the correct amount of movement, again, you can take your Sharpie marker, mark here, mark here when the pedal is all the way down, and see how much movement you have. All of our systems are designed to use factory pedal stops and come all the way against the factory pedal stop or bump stop and actuate completely through the stroke down to your carpeting uh, at the floor without the use of, or without the need rather, of a pedal stop. To verify this system is correct, simply invert the boot on the master cylinder itself. Pull this boot all the way up and out of your way so that you can see this little white or yellow washer that is underneath. From there, you're going to cycle your pedal. The goal in the travel of the rod is to not make contact with this little washer, so keep an eye on it. If you can stroke that all the way down, you're good. Keep in mind, some GM clutch pedals in this instance, we're using a Camaro. There's two holes. Early generation Camaro pedals, some of them only have one hole. You may have to create this one up here. The other thing to pay attention to in any of our systems is the quality of your existing clutch pedal in the car if we're not supplying you a replacement. These arms over time tend to get bent and they sway in. Sometimes that can create an interference condition with the lip on your pedal hanger or it doesn't push straight with the reduction linkage system. So do check those things as well. Modern Driveline offers replacement parts for most vehicles if you need them. Thanks for watching.